if I'm a real estate agent, right? If I'm an agent, what do I do? What do I do? And, and I'll tell you the best advice I've heard lately. And this is from a friend of mine who is a very, very good real estate investor. And he's a developer. And he's got a lot of money invested in the real estate market, right? And I said to him, how are you feeling about this? Like, are you nervous? Are you worried that the market's going to crash? And here's what he said. And I think this is the best advice for you. If you're a real estate agent, you're listening to this. This is what you need to hear is play the market that's in front of you, right? Don't look all the way down in the future and start reacting to something that hasn't happened yet because it might not happen, okay? And the last thing you wanna do is overreact right now and get it wrong, okay? So right now, if inventory is low and the market's strong, then that's what you respond to. The inventory is low, the market's strong, Keep helping buyers and sellers buy houses, help buyers buy houses, help sellers sell houses, stay active. If you own investment properties, hold on to them, right? Don't start liquidating. Don't go crazy right now. If the market shifts, fortunately, real estate doesn't drop like stocks, right? They don't go from, from 100% to zero overnight like a stock does. So if the market does shift, you're going to have plenty of time to respond and react, without you know, losing too much of your position, okay? That's the nice thing about real estate. It doesn't swing that randomly. Um, so, so, so just play the market that's in front of you, right? So right now the market's strong if in your area, play that. If you're in an area like New York or San Francisco and the market's softer, then you play that market, right? But don't start overreacting to situations that aren't occurring right now.